Hey everybody, James Duffy back with Wendell Clark talking about ways to raise your game. We were talking about equipment in our last segment and safety. What about performance? What are the key parts of getting the right equipment to play your best? Well, the biggest thing is, is your skates. You're on them every day, you skate on them the most. Skates have to be fit right and comfortable so they can do everything they're allowed to do. They can't be fit so they can wear them for five years because your feet are going to move, you're going to have soreness in your feet, you won't be able to skate properly. So all of a sudden you, the game's not fun, it's sore to put them on, now you don't want to put them on kind of thing. So skate fitting is huge and, and especially with the technology today and skates, they should feel good right off the bat. And sharpening is something, we all just go sharpen our skates, but there's different ways to be sharpened and the guys at National Sports know it well. It's all a preference thing, isn't it? Well, it is. As they, as they get older, they know what too sharp is. There's different levels of sharpness that they can have, and, and everybody's different. And, and that's where uh, the player, the boy, and the dad should have a conversation with National Sports when they're getting their skate sharpened. Here's how they feel. Uh, here's what feels good and bad to me. And then they can tell them why it feels this way. Uh, the guy that's doing the skates, so then he can help them get a pair of skates that feel even better if they're sharpened properly. It's important to remember there are different ways, different degrees to sharpen your skates. The other thing is stick. You're, you're fickle about the length of stick. I think there's a lot of people that use a stick that's too long because they want to use it forever. And it really started out in probably the wood stick, so you get a long stick and use it forever and it can play for two, three years with it. Where today, uh, not just length, but flexibility of the stick because uh, the sticks now are built a lot like the golf clubs are built. Uh, the stick is there to help you. So if you're using the wrong stick, if it's too stiff, uh, it's not gonna help you shoot the puck. It'll actually hinder you from learning how to shoot the puck right. Uh, so you wanna pick the right flex as well. Uh, so the length of the stick and the flex of the stick is two big things. And the last thing is most guys use too big a curve uh, on their hockey stick because it looks cool. It's the it's the seven-year-old telling the dad what kind of curve he wants versus the dad saying you should learn how to use forehand and backhand and utilize your stick. As you get older, you can get to use the right pattern that you want, but I think probably less curve the better when you're younger, just so you learn how to handle a puck. All great advice, raising your game with Wendell Clark and National Sports.